Hello, I'm Zoe. How the tea is related to coffee? As you are familiar with the coffee, the harvester can pick red cherries and observed the coffee bean was found inside the cherry, basically it's like a seed. Then the process begins for washing, roasting, adding flavors, and drying outside the sun. Whereas, the tea is an aromatic beverage commonly prepared by pouring hot or boiling water over cured or fresh leaves of Camellia sinensis, an evergreen shrub native to East Asia. The tea plant originated in the region encompassing today's northeast India, north Myanmar, southwest China, and Tibet, where it was used as a medicinal drink by various ethnic groups. An early credible record of tea drinking dates to the 3rd century AD, in a medical text written by Hua Tuo. The term herbal tea refers to drinks not made from Camellia sinensis. The word is pronounced differently in the different varieties of Chinese, such as cha in Mandarin, zhou and zhou in Wu Chinese, zie in some Xiang Chinese dialects, and ta and te in Min Chinese. Other pronunciation, such as chai, differently throughout in Russia, Arabic in some parts of Africa, India, Pakistan, and Turkey. If you have differed with the coffee plant, you could only find out the red cherries whether they are harvested by the plantation workers. Hence, the difference is, one is from the tea plants, and other red cherries to harvest coffee. In 1903, the tea bags were patented as a packaging. It is a small, porous, sealed bag or packet, typically containing tea leaves, which is immersed in water to steep and make an infusion. Other packaging products like loose tea, compressed tea, instant tea, and canned tea. Hence, we have satisfied the relation between tea and a coffee. Like, comment, and subscribe now.